May I help you? A dry martini. Shaken, not stout. Certainly, Commander Bond. Where is the girl? Elizabeth Stark, the Prime Minister's youngest daughter. We received word half an hour ago there might be another I kidnapping attempt. Closer to home. She doesn't appear concerned. Why should she be, with 007 here to protect her? Too bad. The game is over, Mr. Bond. I think it's just begun. Shut up! Bond. James Bond. You are indeed the killer I'm looking for. When do I get to kill the real James Bond? After he steals from the Russians their new Lector decoding machine. And Bond is going to do it for us? We assume that's who MI6 will send. There is a girl in the Russian consulate in Istanbul, Tatiana Romanova, who I've ordered to help. She believes I am still with KGB. But won't MI6 suspect it's a trap? My reading of the British mentality is that they always see a trap as a challenge. And then you can avenge the death of our Dr. No. Let Bond's death be a particularly unpleasant and humiliating one. I look forward to it. And for my next miracle? You're going to need a miracle, James, to explain where you've been all week. Oh, money, Penny. Let me tell you the secret of the world. You'll have time for that later, 007. Step into my office immediately. Good morning, 007. Oh, good morning, Q. How have you been? Busy inventing things? Not as busy as you've been destroying them. Follow me, 007. 
and try not to break anything. Congratulations, 007. Your training is complete. Now use this device to get yourself to Istanbul. An airline ticket. How ingenious. I expect you to return my equipment, along with the Lector device, in pristine condition. I'll bring it back. From Russia with love. Can I borrow a match? Oh, I use a lighter. It's better still. Until they go wrong. Welcome to Istanbul, Mr. Bond. Your transportation is here, sir. James, my friend. How nice to see you. Karen Bay. It's been too long. Interesting car. Limited edition? Your man Q sent it ahead. Warned me not to touch any of the buttons. You were wise to take his advice. Otherwise, you might not live to regret it. Come. They're waiting for us at Station T. I'll drive. that your truce with the Russians has just ended. But I didn't order an attack. Then who did? I don't know. But the Russians are going to blame us. You'd best get us out of here. Something tells me they're serious about this, James. Is there another way to the station? No. We have to get past the tank. Can you do it? It's difficult but not insurmountable. Wait here. Outstanding, 007. A bit over the top, but well done. Now, on to Station T. Welcome to Station T, James. On the Constantinople era. You know your history. I've always been interested in the rise and fall of civilizations and preventing the downfall of ours. Again, what happened? The Russians stormed the building. They've rigged bombs to explode. Have they taken hostages? Yes, several. I'm going in. work, Bob. Well, thanks, Karen. But the question remains, why did the Russians decide to go to war now? I wonder if my arrival had something to do with it. Maybe yes, maybe no. Perhaps we need to look in on the Russian consulate and find out who's behind the attacks. It's time to spy on the spies. Let's get to the Russian consulate. Before the locals start asking questions, we don't have answers for. Good idea. There's an underground waterway that leads to a cistern from where we can spy on them. But first, we have to get past a Russian checkpoint. We'll pick up some uniforms at my son's house. Another family business? In my world, blood is the best security. Yes, and let's not try to spill any more of it. Here's the canal. We follow it to a cistern that takes us to the surveillance room under the consulate. I'll give you a hand with the boat. Stay here, and I'll get the winch. There they are! Kill them! Splendid. Good going so far, James. Now all we need to do is follow these tunnels until we're under the consulate. Once we're there, the surveillance room is hidden off to the side. 
And we can look in on our friends, the Russians. Let's hope it's smooth sailing. Welcome to the Russian consulate, directly above us. A gift from your Royal Navy. Oh, fantastic. How did you arrange it? A cousin in the public works department had the building declared unsafe. The Russians moved out and we've moved in. The sun will come up in a moment. Do you see anything? I see our lector. And it seems to be the topic of discussion. Who's the general? Krilenko. KGB. He'd be responsible for the attacks against us. Hmm. Things are shaping up nicely. Ah, the girl. Yes. Karen Bay has powerful allies. He's in league with the surrounding gypsies, and we simply cannot push him out. I don't care. Take everything we have and assault their camp. I'll lead them myself. Something about a camp of gypsies. My friends. Need an armed lector. Just put it in the vault. We will deal with it later. They said something about attacking a gypsy camp and putting the lector in a vault. I must warn my friends. What about the vault? Do you know where it is? No, but they keep the blueprints in the communications room. You go save your friends. Take the boat. And you? I'll find my own way out after I get those blueprints. Did you retrieve the blueprints? Yes, and I see you've warned your friends. Yes, we're ready. But in the meantime, it seems that another crisis has sprung up. Follow me. Two girls in love with the chief's son have threatened to kill each other. They're going to settle it the gypsy way. He's a lucky man, the chief's son. First of all, we need to take out that turret. Trelinko's men have taken hostages in those buildings. Right. Wait, they're using tear gas. You'll need to get a gas mask from the supply wagon. I'm on my way. It seems they're preparing for a final attack. Krilenko's hit! He's running! But who shot him? Let's not question our good fortune. Get his rifle and meet me in the tower. We'll make our final stand there. You fought well, my friend. The gypsy chief wants to make you an honorary son. Oh, thank him for me. How's your arm? I'll live. But the problem is, so did Krilenko. We have to finish him off. He's standing between me and the lector. Take us back into Istanbul. I know where Krilenko went. A secret hideout? In Istanbul, nothing remains secret for very long. So I'm learning. Did you tell anyone at the consulate you are coming here? No, of course not. Good. This mission must remain a secret. But what am I to do with the English agent when I meet him? Whatever he asks. You may go. Do you have news of the Krilinko situation? It's soon to end. Bond is on his trail. Krilinko will not be able to protect the lector after tonight. Perfect. Twice has Krilenko tried to kill me. The third time he will succeed, unless we kill him first. That wound doesn't look good. You'd better leave Krilenko to me. I'm already too much in your debt. 
How can a friend be in debt? Hmm? You are kind, but I have to be the one he sees last. If you insist, I'll find a sniper point and cover you. Once again, my friend, I'm in debt to you for saving my life. Uh, don't take it personally, Karim. It's the lector I'm after. <laughs> and you shall have it. My son has arranged your meeting with Tatiana Romanova. Well, in that case, I'd say we're even. You look surprised. My friends call me Tonya. Mine call me James Bond. You look just like your photograph. You look even better than yours. Thank you. But I think my mouth is too big. No. It's the right size. For me, that is. Has everything been arranged for tomorrow with the lector? Mm. Do we have to talk about that now? Yes. It's in the vault. I'll be waiting for you with the lock codes at 12.45 in the operations room. Well, I hope I haven't disappointed you. I will tell you in the morning. Let's get to work. I'm going to have a look around inside. And when I talk to the passport clerk, that's your signal to set off the distraction. Good luck, James. Nice to see you again, Tanya. Let's go. We have a date with Elector. We need to get the elevator moving again. Do you know where the override is? In a security room on the ground floor. But we can't get there without the elevator. Here! We have a train to catch. Hopefully before the Russians catch us. The Orient Express leaves for Belgrade within the hour. We have to be on that train. The streets are going to be crawling with the Russians looking for us and the Lecter. We'll split up. Two targets are harder to hit than one. See you on the train. Agreed. Good luck, my friend, as always. Can I borrow a match? I use a lighter. Better still. Until they go wrong. Hello, old man. I'm Captain Nash. M sent me. I've been working undercover in Yugoslavia. Let's go. Meet me in the dining car this evening, and you can fill me in on the escape plan. Cats? Hey, cats? Come in. Just give me one second. Take all the time you'd like. <laughs> Sit down, old man. What do you have? Grilled salt. Make it two. And bring us some wine. Red wine. So tell me about the escape plan. The plan, old man, is that you die on the train. I should have known. Red wine with fish. KGB? Of course. Octopus. And the girl? Is she in on this? She thought she was helping Mother Russia. Now stand up. We're going for the lector. Pity to miss a meal.
Take care of him. There's your white wine, old man. Let's go. We're pulling into the station. Let me finish. The KGB are here. We have to leave now. Tanya, come on. There's no time to lose. What happened? We were duped. Octopus has been playing us against each other. Stay close. Neither of us has any friends here. I have to get the lector back. So you had me deliver it on a plate. It's brilliant. The first bullet won't kill you, nor the second, not even the third. Not until you get over here and kiss my foot. Tell me, which lunatic asylum did they get you out of? Sorry we're late, Mr. Bond. Where's my dad? I'm sorry. Your father's dead. The Russians? Octopus. They've got the lector. Take the girl to the safe house. I've got some scores to settle. Looks like you've tracked Eva to an octopus smuggling operation. Destroy the installation and put them out of business. There's a dock nearby. If you can get there, you can get out. Tanya, into the car. We have plenty of fuel. With luck, we should make the border by the morning. Take the wheel. You didn't expect it to be smooth sailing, did you? Tanya, full speed. Keep us straight. What are you doing?
Bond. I'll hold. Oh, that should be the bell, Captain. There's money for a tip on the table. Good morning, 007. M here. Morning, sir. We're on our way to the airport. It should be routine from here on in. Not so fast, 007. It seems another matter has come up with our friends from Octopus. I'll pick you up in a helicopter. A Web. But what's going on? Your time is up, Mr. Bond. Romanova, get the door and the left door. Yes, she's had her kicks. 24 hours ago, we received a message from Optimus. They've stolen a nuclear weapon and are threatening to blow up London unless we pay them a hundred million pounds. And you've tracked the weapon to here? We believe it's the Octopus secret base. Not anymore. to M. I'm on my way out. The missile is disabled. The base is rigged to blow. Not so fast, old man. You should have made sure I was dead. This time I will. You're gonna shoot me in cold blood, old man. You don't have the guts. It's not the English way. It's like red wine with fish. That was for Kerry. James, now that it's over, I hope you don't find me disappointing. I'll let you know in the morning.